Solomon. One of the most trending, if not the most trending sneaker brand over the past few years, Solomon is popular for a good reason. Their sneakers are in a really great price range from $100 on sale to $200 at retail. And their shoes are a trifecta of being durable, functional, but also still staying very comfortable. And all of their shoes have this really unique aesthetic and design that you're not really gonna find anywhere else on the sneaker market. So because of all these reasons, Solomon has been one of my favorite sneaker brands over the last few years. And it's actually one of the last few brands where I'm still excited about future collaborations that are coming out. So again, Solomon's, they have a really unique aesthetic and design, but because of that unique aesthetic, they can be a little bit more intimidating to style at first. But for myself, after owning a few pairs of Solomon's and different silhouettes and different colorways, they're actually not as intimidating as I initially felt like they would be. So this video is basically just me sharing how I like to style Solomon's. So let's get right into it. So the first model I have here, the Solomon XT6s. This is probably their most popular model. It's the model I've actually seen out in the real world of other people wearing them. And I've styled this model before. So if you wanna check out that bonus fit, you can check out that video here. Or if you're looking for a detailed review on the XT6s, I've also done a video on that here. The ones I have here are a collaboration with End Clothing out in the UK. This is their Porcini colorway in a really beautiful orange and brown. And the fit that I have here is essentially cozy streetwear slash gorpcore. Up top, we have this beautiful teal fleece from the North Face. This is their 94 retro Denali fleece. On the bottoms, we also have a piece from the North Face. These are their techwear pants in black. And the accessory that kind of pairs it all together, we have this utility tote bag from Supreme. And for this fit, I just love the color contrast from the teal on the fleece to the orange on the sneakers. So for XC6s, I think they can look really complex and intimidating at first, but doing some very simple color styling and selecting comfortable pieces that are still functional, I think you can easily style the XC6s and you don't have to overthink it. So next silhouette from Solomon, these are the XT4s in all black, and this is just a general release pair. XT4s are still fairly popular, but definitely not as popular as XT6s. But overall, I think this is just as great of a sneaker, and they're actually just as easy to style. So styling the XT4s, I have this fit where it's kind of a refined streetwear look. Up top, we have this really nice refined, but still casual blazer from Uniqlo U. The bottoms here, we have some olive tapered chinos, also from Uniqlo, and for the fit, that's pretty much it. But I think it really shows that there are easy ways to dress up this sneaker with a lot of different refined pieces, even though this sneaker is technical at its core. So for styling Solomons, it doesn't always have to be Gorp Core, even though it is a Gorp Core sneaker. Next model from Solomon, the XA Pro 3Ds. And this is their collaboration with Anne Wander out in Tokyo. And overall, this model just has a really niche aesthetic. It's kind of that hiker slash sneaker boot look, but to me, it's actually super versatile and I love the look of this sneaker. But to style these, the fit I picked is very much me. It's a big blend of streetwear slash workwear slash gorpcore. Up top, we have a nice hoodie from Nike with some embroidery on the chest. Layered over that, we have a washed black denim jacket from Uniqlo and on the bottom, we have some nylon black pants from Nike ACG, and these are called the Sunfarers. And both the colorway and the rugged elements of this collaboration match the workwear aesthetic of the denim jacket, and also the gorp core styling of Solomon's in general match the nylon pants from the ACGs. And so really, I feel like this collab pair brings in elements, again, from all those three styles, whether it's streetwear, workwear, or gorp core. And this outfit just really continues that trend. And together, all three, I think, blend together pretty seamlessly, and I really like this fit. Hey, something special for this vid. Two bonus fits by today's sponsor, Black Taylor. Black Taylor is a streetwear brand that specializes in cargos, but as you can see, they have a lot more than just cargos. In fact, they have one of my favorite slim fitting shirts ever. This is their crop tee. And even though they were nice enough to send me two, I'm already planning on going back to buy four more. And of course, great pants. These are their N3 cargos. A really nice washed soft cotton with contrast stitching. These go great with the blacked out XT4s. Pairing the crop shirt and N3s together, it's just a really easy yet stylized way to rock Solomon's while wearing all black. And I really love how the contrast stitching on the pants pop for this fit. Shout out to the Travis Scott Phantoms. 
And last piece showcased in this vid, the Y1 cargos. These have a beautiful straight to flared fit done in this really nice nylon material with subtle side pockets. And these sit really nicely over the Solomon XA Pros. For this fit, it's the perfect hybrid of streetwear and workwear. I love this clean take on cargos that pairs beautifully with the rugged Solomons. So if you like these pieces, check out Black Taylor and use DJ Studio for 10% off. Thanks, back to the video. Next sneaker I have, the XT Quests in collaboration with Slam Jam. So this is a really beautiful sneaker because of the silver, but honestly, metallics and silver are just really hard to style at times. So to me, the XT Quests are kind of a do everything sneaker, and I paired that with a do everything fit. But essentially, the styling is just athleisure. But up top, we have a black quarter zip from a essentials brand called Ours. On the bottoms, we have some five inch shorts from Lululemon. These are their zeroed in shorts. And of course, if you don't know already, one of my favorite accessories, this is the Pond normal and Solomon 20 liter pack that I think really ties the fit together. All the pieces are dark tones and I think it actually pairs down really nicely with the silver on this sneaker. I think overall it's just a really nice fit for being active. All the pieces are functional and breathable and when you pair that with a sneaker that was designed to kind of go anywhere, do anything, I think it's overall just a nice cohesive look. And the next sneaker from Solomon, these are their X Alpages. This is their collaboration with the Broken Arm out in Paris. So this is their sneaker boot model. And this is a really low key Solomon model, even more low key than the XA Pro 3Ds. These just feel so durable in hand and on foot. I feel like if you invested in a pair of these, they'll last you a really, really long time. And the fit that I have here, I think really takes that into account. I'm trying to bring in a lot of casual elements, but also maintaining some of the workwear elements from the sneaker boot and also the other pieces. So up top, we have a Woodland camo cap from Stussy and New Era. The jacket that we have is just an olive shirt jacket from Uniqlo. And on the bottoms, also Uniqlo, these are just some baggy light wash denim. And to pair it all together, we have this slouchy throwback from Grimici. And for this fit, I mentioned those casual tones. I think that really comes through with the light blue on the denim. And the same thing with the slouchy bag from Grimici. I think the styling of it really just gives an easygoing tone to that outfit, but both of those blend surprisingly well with the ruggedness of the boot. I think that the XL pages here are just a nice pop of color for the fit. And overall, the same attributes on this collaboration pair can really be seen throughout the outfit. The casualness of the colors and materials still paired together with some of the rugged workwear elements of this sneaker model. So yeah, styling Solomons can seem really intimidating when you're not into Gorp Core, but hopefully this video helped you see that there are a lot of other styles that you can bring in and pair with Solomons. It doesn't always have to be Gorp Core. So thanks so much for watching. If you like this video, please give it a like, drop a comment, hit the bell, and subscribe. You can follow me on socials here. And if you thought that there is no such thing as a perfect sneaker, it actually exists. And you can check out a video on that here. So with that, thanks so much for watching. I'll catch you in the next one.